Hi YouTube. So two days ago, I posted a video um, showing my my take on this hub home screen, uh, which I found on XDA. And some people have noticed that I've been able to um, navigate to different home screens by pressing on these uh, these navigation bars on the side here. And there's been two comments asking me, "Oh, how 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 did I get this uh, to work?" Because usually what most people have is just a, just a static kind of title there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show how I managed to get these these links to work and also how I got the uh, the folders up there. So I'm just going to go to a, an empty screen here. I guess I was on a good screen. Yeah, I'm going to tap and hold. I'm going to press launcher actions. So I'm going to pick screen 5 okay here it is, I was looking for it I'm gonna move this closer so I can see no, this is not a good screen wallpaper here alright and then what I'm gonna do is I'm, I'm just going to tap it and then hit edit and then I'm gonna change the icon to an invisible icon basically um, there's two ways you can do this. You, if you've installed uh, a secondary icon set from uh, ADW uh, theme themes, you might find some empty icons here. Or if you don't want to install another icon set, you can actually just use the um, the docs that came with ADW launcher actually makes the icon disappear, see? You can press OK and you can see it disappeared. I think it's right here. It's still here, but you can't see it. So, I'm gonna go back. It's still here. So, what I'm gonna do is, and now I'm gonna put the minimalistic um, text widget and then I'm just gonna Pick a random one, let's see, um, two by one. All right, I'm gonna choose a preset. I'm gonna choose games. All right, press back. Hold, hide this. And I'm gonna move this to where the icon was, which was I think here. Oh, it actually, I think it's way up, more up here. Hmm. Oh yeah. Okay. So you have to. You have to move it in place. You can't just overlap them directly. I think it's here. All right. So now we've resized it to overlap. There you go. Press it again. So, I mean, it's only that one square there which has the link, but I've actually put, if you notice on my setup, both squares work for me because I've actually put two um, link, two I hidden icons behind each, each tab here. So it actually took a lot of effort because every screen and every tab, there's two icons behind it. Um, yeah, and... I guess that's it. Um, so if you want, also if you want, um, if you want this to open up a folder, what happens is so you can you can go to um, a built-in function in here, which lets you um, choose the actions when you tap on it. So start another activity, right here, and then I'm gonna choose um, shortcuts. Let's wait for it to load. Having trouble seeing what's going on here. Okay, I have because I use a. I've always been using a, a really uh, useful app called Folder Organizer. Oh, don't know what happened here. All right, I'm just gonna zoom up here. A folder, folder organizer. Okay. Oops. Wow, this is really hard to do. You. Here you go. So I'm going to open up 
Um, just one of my, I guess one I'm going to find games, games, one of my folders from the fo Photo Organizer app. And press back. And now if I click on it, open up the folder. So, I don't actually access my apps from the app drawer anymore. I just go through each folder. Go to each home screen and I find, I click on it and find, get the folder. If I have two folders, then I put it on top here. Right. Um, I guess that's it. Actually, I do have one question. This is slow. See, like it doesn't flick. I have to hold it. And I've noticed this on on widgets for ADW. So I think it has to do with the fact that ADW launcher is not hardware accelerated with the GPU. Um, but this is the only way that I can think of to get this, uh, well, I guess, for it to look this nice. <laughs> Alright, that's it for now. Thanks.